Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, my name is Cordant and today I will start a new video series for a style of game that I don't really usually play which is going to be Resident Evil Village. So uh, for a large while I did not have a computer to actually play <laughs> uh, recent games so I did play Resident Evil 7, I have never touched this one but I have heard many good things so it is now time to try it out for myself. So one of the things the game told me when we were starting is that we can have a little recap of what happened in Resident Evil 7. So we're gonna start by watching this uh, both for myself to refresh my memory on what happened and for you guys as well in case you didn't check out Resident Evil 7. Let's see it. to start. My name? It's Ethan. Ethan Winters. It's been three years since everything happened at the Baker House. I was looking for my wife, who disappeared. I got an email from her. She told me to come get her. And of course, that's how I ended up in the middle of nowhere, Louisiana. I found Mia being held captive in a dark basement. She wasn't thinking right. She attacked me like some kind of wild animal. Later on, I found out that she was infected by a special kind of mold. I looked all over the house trying to find an antidote, a vaccine, anything. People who lived there were already infected. What was left of them wasn't human. The source of the infection was a bioweapon that looked like a little girl. Her name was Evelyn. I fought the fucked up family and was able to treat Mia's symptoms with a serum. Then Chris Redfield and his soldier buddy showed up and saved the both of us. Is that enough? I really don't want to talk about what happened anymore. It's all over now. Okay, that will be enough, Mr. Ethan. So, I'll be honest, I'm not like um, super knowledgeable about Resident Evil lore. I played Resident Evil 1 in my PlayStation 1 when I was a, <laughs> a lot younger. And then I only really played Resident Evil 7 again. I didn't really play anything in between. Resident Evil 7, by the way, is an awesome, awesome game. If you enjoy horror and terror games, uh, it really is a really cool game. I might put it up in the channel sometime. Okay, so this is apparently three years after the events of Resident Evil 7. Ethan saved Mia and now he's gotten himself into some trouble again. Let's find out. Uh, I think I'm gonna go for standard. I'm mostly playing this for the for the Long story. Ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. What the hell Being is strange this? strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled mother's scary bedtime tales and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come child, quench your thirst, he said. Uh. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. <laughs> okay. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared. 
and with a click of his fingers crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beasts. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Yep, exactly. The woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it. Thank God. Mm -hmm. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. Yo. You're just being paranoid. It's not. Chill. Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. I'll finish dinner. Aw. <laughs> it's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. Oh, I'm playing. Did you say something? No. Nope. Nothing. I'll put her down. Yeah, so that that intro story was really, really cool. I would never tell it <laughs> to a small child though. Uh, okay, so this is my house. I'm living with Mia. Mia seems to be a little bit on edge. And I need to take my baby. Oh, upstairs. There, there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. Yep. I agree, Ethan. Mia is crazy. Is this your room? Oh, no. Uh, Almost there, honey. Okay, it should be here. There we go. Ooh, I like that turtle. <laughs> ah, ah, indeed. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. She's cute. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Okay. I think I need to adjust the sensitivity of my mouse. Sorry for the, the break in immersion, guys. Uh, mo uh, no, not controller. Ah, there you go. Maybe, maybe go for the six. I guess that's better. Okay. It's still a bit slow, but I will get used to it. Oh, come on. How can you do such detailed graphics and not do a mirror? That's weird. Can I run? No. Oh. Looking good. 
Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Mmm, <laughs> that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de lagum. It's a local recipe. Oh. Wow, you've gone full native. Fancy. Mm -hmm. Local wine, too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. You really have to stop worrying. It's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <laughs> Oh! She was shot! Mia, get down! No! Okay. Well. Um. I guess my concern right now is for the baby. Oh God. Chris, what the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! Um... What? Why? Why, dude? He's the guy that saved me in Resident Evil 7, right? Go move! Oh, chill, dude. Bobby, no! All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Back in secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Um. Rose. Get him out. Well, that's, that's quite the start. That is quite the start, my friends. Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I got your daughter's results back and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about the next test before o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. Is the baby infected? Doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. I keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just won't. Mia, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. To just delay the call. Uh, oh, my little angel. Okay, we're back in the present, I guess. Jesus. Oh, these are the men that took me, right? About damn time. What's your dad? It's a package thing. What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Here. Okay. So the main character is is saying fuck. So 
I guess it's okay for me to do the same thing. So what the fuck happened here, man? This guy is one of the people that took me and my baby. Okay, the phone is useless. Mission objectives. Eliminate target, recover body. Secure Rosemary Winters and Ethan Winters. Yeah, only only my daughter and myself were, were of any concern. Mia was just dead weight. Move the two Winterses <laughs> to Site C for a further investigation. At least two transport officers to accompany them. Okay, so this means there should be another guy somewhere around here. Okay, so I, I can't run. Poor Ethan, man. He just can't get a break. Where am I going? Oh god. Dude, this is this is I'm getting a lot of Outlast vibes. Ah. Noob. Okay, so we can stand up. We are standing up. Let's not die in the tutorial, please. Yo, this is blood, right? Oh, it's a, it's a crow. Wonderful. Dead ravens everywhere. Condemned criminal origins. For those of you who might know what that means, you shall get the reference. It's a very detailed looking dead bird. Yeah, this is, this is, uh, ominous. <laughs> to say the least. You bitch. Yeah, 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 yeah. Shut up. What would you do if you were in this situation? I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I would do. I guess moving forward is the only way, right? But god damn. Dead birds, dead fish, creepy wild animal man looking thing running up ahead of us. He must have ran into this house because there's no other way to go. God. Is there like an axe or a shovel? I would even be happy with the flashlight, to be honest. Just give me something, please. A rope? Take the rope! Nope. Some rotten potatoes. Um, okay. I have the feeling there's gonna be a jump scare. <laughs> but it kind of... It kind of looks like there's somebody living here. Okay, nothing to pick up. Jesus Christ, man. Yeah, this is not creepy at all. That's very cool, though. 
Oh god. No vampires here. Good. Good. Son of a bitch. Yeah, nah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't open this. No. <laughs> oh, okay. That's that's not that bad. Um. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> I don't wanna. Somebody broke through the goddamn house. Something strong. I'm guessing it was the the man animal thing we saw running above um ahead of us. Yeah, we came through there and now there's a hole on the wall. Okay, now we can run. Cool. Can I jump? Oh no, I can block. Oh! Where the hell am I? Dude, this is really cool. This is really pretty. I like the windmill. Um, I, I think the way to go is down. Yep. Okay, we are fine. Yeah, so dead ravens, dead fish, dead horse. It's a very chunky horse. <laughs> just just give me a shotgun, please. An easy to pick lock. Maybe maybe they're out. Okay, food. Jesus Christ, man. Yeah, I don't think anybody is living here. Something cut through this sofa. But but there's cooking on the stove, so I need a lock pick. I Yeah, you saw that, right? I saw that. I hope I don't forget the lock pick. Syringes. Oh, wonderful. They're growing syringes here. Okay. Uh Are these dead baby birds? Jesus Christ, man. Okay, there's some There's something down the well. This needs some kind of other item. Okay. So we need the lock pick and we need a, a lever of some sort. Okay. A lot of blood. I'm guessing this is where the horsey was being kept before he died. Before I go over there, I still want to check the other area. Uh, 
Okay, so there's nothing over here. There's a truck. This is where the body was being pulled. Nothing of use. I think these are footprints. But I am not entirely sure. There are tire tracks. Man, this game is very, very pretty. Ah, so the okay. So I'm I'm on the same place I would be if I had come from here. Okay. Do not enter. I will need to open this lock somehow. Also cannot pass. Well, the only way is through here, friends. What is this doing here? Really? Out of all the things that are in front of us, <laughs> that's... That's what stands out to you. Hmm. Nothing over there. It's kind of esoteric symbol. Okay. I think I've gone everywhere. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, okay, I'm still missing this area. Jesus Christ. Goat heads. With their tongue sticking out. <sighs> what happened? <laughs> he seems very calm. He seems extremely calm, considering what's in front of us. This was freshly killed, by the way. Graveyard, workshop, ceremony site. Corn. Locked due to missing homeowner. Okay, so the, the people living here are clearly doctors. <laughs> it's locked. It seems to require some sort of symbol, maybe. Pizza oven. Cool. Nothing over here. Ah, God, dark place. Yeah, some force would break it. <sighs> A knife. Okay. Let me see if I still remember how to play this. I'm assuming it's similar to... Um, to Resident Evil 7. So this is blocking. This is a heavy attack. This is a light attack. Okay. First aid med. Open inventory. Uh, we are healthy. Medicine that fully heals all wounds. Shift. Oh, I can also send it to in uh? to temporary items. No, no. Okay. I can craft stuff. Key items. Family photo. Can I open it? I can. Can I rotate it? I can. 
Okay. And there's also... Treasure. Hmm. Okay. So I picked up the knife. Maybe this means I can... Um, Lockpick the other uh, drawer with the knife. Did they just run out of the house? It looks like chicken soup. <laughs> um, okay, so I guess I need to get out again. Oh, I don't know. Shit. Ah. I see. Um okay. So where do I go now? Through here? Can I go through here? Ah, yes I can. Yeah. Oh Jesus! <clears throat> Friendly. Friendly. Sorry. Who are you? <laughs> Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down on the road and Dude, what's going on? <laughs> this old man looks very oh. funny looking. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Because I will need it, I'm guessing. Thank you. Take it. Oh my lord. Whoa. Hey, are you listening? Hey! Oh! Uh, uh, at least leave the shotgun? Ethan, run away, man. Oh. Um. Oh God. Wait, this is not the old man. Wait, there's more. Yeah, there are. Jesus Christ. Okay, so how do I? Okay. Uh, I think there was like a an interaction queue somewhere around here. Maybe I just saw wrong. Yeah, I think Jesus he's dead. Jesus Christ. What the hell is wrong with this place? Huh. Is that moving? That is moving. Dude, get out the gun. Get out the gun. Get out the goddamn gun. Oh, fuck you! Shoot him! Mm -hmm. Um. What the fuck um. Dude, get the gun out! Oh my lord, man! Oh! J Will you die? Oh! Okay, he doesn't die. Dead? What the hell? Dude! What the hell, man? Jesus. Um I'm still fine apparently. <laughs> Which is kind of amazing. Uh, whoops. Like this. I have six bullets. They take a lot of bullets to go down. Oh god, is this another one? Ah, 
Nice. Okay. Oh, this is a key item. I'll have to check if if my microphone volume is too loud and I'll I'll lower it for the the future videos if that's the case. Chem fluid. Okay, this is for crafting, I think. Yes. Lovely apples though. Oh, a herb. Craft first aid med. Okay. So, first aid med, I can just press F. Item crafted. Achievement unlocked! Crafter! Yeah! A tool for cutting chains. Okay. Jesus, man. Um, no, the, okay, so this is where the guy got killed, but I, he did not drop his shotgun, and I got pulled under, I'm guessing over there, okay, so we gotta go some other way now, ah, okay, keep the bolt cutters please, of course not. <laughs> Why? Why is it that games do this? The bolt cutter isn't gonna break by cutting a single chain. Uh, I think this is a new spot. I forgot to block as well. Oh, my hand. My hand isn't doing great. Yeah, I came from here. Dead body. Wonderful. Ah, okay. Nothing. Dude, if something comes out this window. Oh, you bitch! Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Oh no. Oh no. Oh shit! This is not the time for it, Ethan. Go away. Chem fluid and some bullets. Oh god, is he coming in? Wait, wait. I don't know what's happening. Where do I even go? Not over there. Oh no. this rusted scrap for crafting okay I killed one is it over and I keep forgetting to block Hello. Huh? if there are any survivors out there come to my 
to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? Uh, to Louisa's house. Okay, so there's nothing else up here. Oh, this body got dropped. I came from over there. I... I don't remember if... Oh! Yeah, no. No, 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 no. Oh, god damn it. I see that bitch over there. If I shoot him, more will come. Um, yeah. You know what? <laughs> Can I save the game? Oh no, it's only based on checkpoints. Wonderful. So I don't want to go over there. I don't want to go over there. Can they see me? Like, I'm crouching, but this guy is right above me. <gasps> oh, you utter bitch. Wait, this is the other side, right? Okay. I don't feel confident about this. Please don't see me. I'm still gonna be greedy though. Shh. Shut up. Shh. Oh god! Oh god. Um. Uh, I have gunpowder. I have bullets. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Survive the attack. Wow, that sounds great, doesn't it? It's full of flour. I have two bullets. Or two shells, I should say. Okay, this guy wants to come in. Oh, there's several. There's several. This fucker has an axe. Okay, dead. Oh my lord. I got a crystal skull, which I don't know what it means. There's no end to them. Okay, he just said there's no end to them, which means I probably should kinda get the hell away from here. Go away! Uh, give me the thing! What is this? It's a treasure. More flour. I have no ammunition. Arrows? What the hell? Oh! Oh my lord! Dude, leave me alone! Run! Run! Jesus Christ! Oh, come on! Come on! Yeah, I'm, I'm very dead. Uh, uh, what 
the hell is that? Okay, wait, can I, can I? <laughs> Let's craft ammunition. I think I know what I need to do. I'm just not sure if I will be able to reach it in time. With all of these animals. Maybe I need to go up there. <sighs> nope. Did this help? Nope, not really. Oh boy. Um. 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 <laughs> let me pass. Is this what I. Is this a new place? It is a new place. Okay. <laughs> Ammunition. Ammunition. Okay, I gotta get the hell away from here. Uh, how do I go up? I'm still alive. Uh. Jesus. I have no idea. What? <clears throat> Did I... am I... Oh, it's a cutscene. What the hell is this? So, I'm dead. Yeah. I'm not dead? He doesn't seem friendly. What's happening? They just let me live? Ah, wonderful. Yep, still no hand. <sighs> Poor Ethan, dude. Oh, old lady. Achievement unlocked, not liking this. Um, okay, so I'm kind of guessing that this was a checkpoint, hopefully. I am going to end the episode here. We managed to stay alive. Thank God. <laughs> There's still some stuff I want to explore in this area. There's this... Oh. Oh. There's this door to open, there was the other thingy, the drawer to lockpick. I think this is from killing enemies. The items on the floor. Hmm. Okay, well, I gotta say that was a, a great, great start. A lovely introduction, very creepy, very well done. And then this village section, god damn. Um, so yeah. Uh, thank you so much guys for being here with me in the channel watching some Resident Evil Village um, It's been a great start like I said hopefully the rest of the game can keep up with the excitement If you guys have any questions or suggestions leave a comment below If you want to get notified about other videos coming to the channel feel free to subscribe It's a free and easy way to support my channel and videos are coming out every single day And I hope to see you guys in the next episode until then Let's hope Heathen stays alive and stay safe, everyone.